Let's speak with Varl and continue our mission. Angry orb. <laughs> there she is. You ready to head out? I am ready to get going. Let's go. Look at us. Three battle-hardened badasses forging into the unknown. This ought to be good. So we have to investigate the mysterious signal being sent to Gaia, and um, hopefully it's not a trap, but I have a feeling that it is probably a trap. In some way. Yeah, this distress call had to be up a really steep mountain, huh? Yeah, Aaron doesn't seem like the uh, climbing type. This isn't good. What is that? What the hell? Dude, what do they have? Takes the keg. I don't know, but I think it managed to penetrate the shield and um, they actually stabbed the uh, far zenith person, I think. Burl, see if there's anything over there. On it. Yeah, that was pretty we'll cool. Check out the battlefield. Let's start with that zenith. Well, there are obviously more zeniths than we know about. Dude, they managed to, uh... Almost didn't make it. They managed to take her out. Whatever the rebels did, it took down her shield. But why was she here? I can access her last communication file, but... I'll use my focus to scan the battlefield, too. What about that crazy weapon the Zenith had? It looked like she can make it come and go at will. What? But Hello, Verbena? What do you have uh, for me? Well, go do your thing. I checked thing. everywhere, still I'll no sign here. of the asset. Can we call off this pointless search already? Let's not forget who let it slip away in the first place. Now, I'd like to see results by nightfall. Do you think you can manage that? Hold on. I think I see something. Okay, guys. Let's examine the specter. I'm pretty sure Aloy's out here in some flip-flops, man. In the snow? You're gonna get frostbit. What a mess. The specter had instructions to assist recovery of the asset. I wonder what this asset is. I don't know, but they look like the uh, corruptors. They look like the corruptors. Okay, guys. We'll scan the battlefield, see what else we need to look for. Okay guys, let's grab the supply crate. What else do we have? A dart gun? Whose gun is this? Is this hers? That's pretty cool. Alright everyone, let's go this way. We got some stuff up here to investigate. If I can figure out how to get up there. So this is where they use that uh, machine. With a focus. Looks like he was sending data on the weapons somewhere else. Telemetry log. Okay. Ah. Ah. Weapon's still hot. 
I need to know how it worked. But I'll have to check on it once it's cooled off. Alright everyone, what do we go to now? Anything further up? Ooh, there's some good stuff up here. Let's go. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Get this from my stash when I need it. Okay guys, where else am I supposed to search? There's a Ravager there. Okay guys, is there anything else I'm missing here? Let me take a look before we go down. There's another body right there. Did I investigate this body? There's something else over here. Okay. I wanted to make sure I wasn't missing anything. Looks like the rebels camped here for a while. Are they watching this area? All right. I think I have an idea what happened here. I better get back to Errand. What a mess. Game is so beautiful. Just look at those tracks in the snow. I love some good tracks in the snow. <laughs> All right, she who sees the unseen. What did you find out? This was a carefully planned attack. I found camping gear up there. The rebels must have been staking out this place for at least a few days. They were waiting for the Zeniths to show up. All so that they could test that weapon. The Zeniths have a personal shield that makes them invulnerable, but somehow the weapon got rid of it. The Osirum that was operating, it was sending data on it somewhere else. I was probably just a prototype. I've known tinkers that do that. I'd do a little trial run before breaking out the real thing. Well, I guess it's still a work in progress, if it blew up. She was searching for something she lost. Her drone had instructions to recover something called the Asset. The asset? Is that the uh, sub-function thing that you said could be here? The Luthia? I'm not sure. Come on, let's go talk to Varl. Right, everyone, where's Varl? Okay, so he's over here. I still can't get over Aloy uh, running around in the snow in some flip-flops, guys. I might have to actually uh, change that. It's just so... It just doesn't work. You know, it's just too cold, guys. It's gonna frostbite your feet. <laughs> I might have to change outfits. Varl out here in the sleeveless shirt. That's a long way down. Something tunneled straight down into the mountain. Looks recent. Dude, that looks frightening. Whatever it was, it must have been powerful. That zenith the rebels killed was looking for something called the asset. I don't know what it is. But my guess is it's somewhere down there. All right, so we head down. Erend, stay here and stand watch. That zenith isn't the only one of its kind. I don't want to be caught by surprise if the others show up. Contact us by focus if you see anything. Okay. If any trouble shows up, I'll call you. Let's go. Hey okay, guys, let's get down here. Investigate the facility. Okay, let's go through here. Make sure we're not missing anything There's as we some go. Kind of old world ruin down here. You said the Zeniths have their own backup of Gaia, oh, dang right? It. Yeah, from the Proving Lab. Okay, I have something to look up there. It's so okay. maybe they were after Eleuthia, found its hiding spot, so it sent the distress signal. Maybe. Looks like some kind of data center. I might be able to access the facility systems from that console. Dude, what is this? A transmitter. I've never seen a transmitter like this before. Looks like it's self-destructed. That is crazy. These Zeniths are a wild bunch, man. They have some this was a far Zenith research lab. crazy technology. Looks like a lot of data was beamcast from here recently. From that device nearby. So Eluthi is gone? If it was ever here, then probably. But then so, why were the Zeniths still searching another for it? Far the ruin. At least this one doesn't seem to have giant killer machines. 
for yes, anything. Yes, because I can love blow up. these supply Stash chests. Love a such I love a supply chest, guys. Those are so nice. I've got to get whatever supply I need to increase my potions pouch. I need more medical potions or health potions, I mean. Um, Aloy, where are you going? <laughs> you just started climbing the walls, guys. All this stuff. Wonder what they were doing here. Well, knowing Far Zenith, probably discovering amazing things. For their own benefit. Yeah. That sounds about right. Everyone, can we go through this door? No, we cannot. I don't see anything useful in here, actually. Yeah, I guess we need to continue maybe this way. Did we just come from this way? I feel like we did. I'm going to get lost in here, guys. Okay, we came up the stairs. Let's go back down. See if it tells us to go back up. What is down here? The place just gets deeper and deeper. Down in B42. Okay, we have a uh, data point here. Text to mail. We have lost the brightest star among us. Research on ectogenesis for the Odyssey was near and dear to Peter. Okay, ectogenesis. I don't know what that is. Okay, guys, we got another valuable resource thing. Ancient valuables box. All right, we have a few things in here. Another data thing. Ancient metal eye. Why does she keep climbing on random stuff, Aloy? Find anything that might tell us what the asset is. Um, I was trying to look. I don't think so. Let's see. That didn't work. Alright guys, let's keep going. I guess we haven't been this direction. Oh, hold on. Got something over here. What is this? Another valuables chest. I'll take all the valuables you got. Okay, I don't think we've been through here. This place is huge. Some kind of storage room, maybe. Maybe the asset is in here somewhere. If it is, somehow the Zenith couldn't find it. Let's look around. Hey guys, let's take a so, look here. Um, how is Erend taking all of this? Really? Well, Gaia, the Zeniths, Focus. It's a lot. But when I caught up to him in the dawn and said you needed our help, he dropped everything and turned around. Well, he's loyal. That's for sure. Guys, there's so much good stuff here, man. I just have to take it all. Hey, Louie, quit climbing the chest. Okay. Let's get up here, guys. I think we're heading this direction. Oh, there's more loot, guys. I just can't help myself. There's so much good stuff. And I need it all. I really do need it all because I always find myself not having enough stuff. Okay, we have health potions sent to our stash, dude. We have so much good stuff. I need to check my stash. Console. To access the storage units. Can it tell us if the asset is in one of them? Well, let's find out. I want to check out this door over here real quick before we go in there. Or before we examine this console. What is over here? What is this room here? An office? Anything interesting in this office? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's examine the console, everyone. See if we can learn any new information. 236 containers in storage. Please enter the container number you'd like to retrieve. 236? Wasn't there a number in the distress signal? It was like 237, maybe? Right. I should check the log. I'm just going to try and guess it by actual memory here. Dude, I'm so good. I haven't played this game for a day, and I remember the code. <laughs> 
1-800-273-6237. Imagine that's the wrong code and it just says, Mission failed, you've died. <laughs> oh my goodness, these are people. These are people. That's the clone. Aloy. It's you. Skin's like ice. Must have cut this from her head. But why? Apologies, I don't know what else to call you. Um, my name is Beta. I'm afraid I must be brief. I only have a few minutes before my keepers discover I'm missing, and I still need to remove this implant. I had hoped to find shelter with you, but if you're viewing this, I, I may be dead. Be careful when you take on Farsiness. They are ruthless, and they have Aluthia, Artemis, and Apollo now. But at least they don't have the Gaia kernel to march them with. You must succeed. Oh, this was all for nothing. Good luck. And goodbye. So she's... She's still alive. We need to get her back to... No, you better oh, just put her back in the... Uh... What's going on, Aaron? Two of those spectral things just fell out of the sky. One of them is heading down towards you. The other one's waiting up here. We're coming up. Stay in cover until I get there. You got it. Get her to cover in that room. Whatever happens, she stays with us. So all of these people are just cryogenically frozen, I guess? I'll protect her. What about all these other people? I should prepare before the Spectre gets here. I can't let it get through to Varl on the clone. Okay, guys, let me refill on all my... All my stuff here. I'm not sure what they are um, immune to. I have no idea. i um, probably going to need some... Big bow, some big precision arrows. Probably going to need definitely some of these explosive spike throwers. I need to get a better spike thrower. That would be really nice. Okay. Um, so where are they over here in this door? Here it comes. Didn't give me much time. Hey, come on, Ooh, you. Ugly one, aren't you? Okay, I need you to come up here and get shocked. Okay, that did some good. There we go. Okay, can I scan this thing? I should scan that thing. See if it has any weak spots. No idea. Okay, I don't know. I still don't know if it has weak spots. But I can possibly chirp wire this thing. Oh, I have the shocks. I think it's a I think it's I think it can be shocked easily. That thing's quick. Okay, it's not really doing much at all. Okay, I need it to run into these. I need you to run into these, please. Ow, that hurt. Run into this. Ow, that hurt. It's not running into it. Oh, that hurt. Okay, please don't be shooting at me. Okay, I'm just going to have to shoot it here. Okay, I can't... I see no weak spots on this stupid thing. Detachable... Plasma unit. 
Okay, guys, it actually did scan some weak spots. Let's find them. Weak versus poison. Plasma unit. Okay, tag that. Okay, poison. We're gonna poison this thing. Hey, I have some poison traps. Let's go. Acid traps. Not not poison. Acid. I keep calling that poison. It's not poison. It's acid. Okay, guys, we got acid. We got it acided. <laughs> I don't even know how to say that. Okay, come on, you. Yes. Okay, come here, you. Oh, that was a big shot, I think. That was good. I don't know what to shoot. I need to shoot those laser beams or whatever those are. There we go. Okay, guys, I feel like... Oh, I was going to say, I think one hit from this could probably kill me. I need to get it over here. Oh my god, as soon as I say that. Are you serious? Don't worry, guys. We're putting the hurt on it again. Oh no, I just... I just blew up my own acid trap. Why is it... Oh god. Go, 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 go. Hey, Lloyd. Come on. Come over here, you. I need to hit you with some acid. Can you get in this trap, please? Okay, I need to get it. I need you to hit this trap, please. There we go. Okay, guys, now time to hit it with that. Oh, no. That did it. That definitely did it. There. Are you okay, Aloy? Yeah, I'm heading up top. Stay down here with the clone for now. Okay, hey guys, let me I'll dismantle this. Clear. Let me dismantle this since I'll get a little bit of something back for it. Okay, guys, can I craft any more of these? These shock traps are actually really good. Can I craft some more of these? These were really good. I like these because they can, they can get them when they walk through it and when they jump over it, which is really nice. Let's do acid. Can I get some acid traps? I really like the traps in this game, man. I did not use a lot of them in Zero Dawn, but in this game, they're really effective. They're really effective. Okay. Let's head back up top, guys. We have a good idea of how to defeat them. Let me just make sure I'm full up on this. I love the spike thrower. It is so good. It is so, so good. And then you use this to just take off machine components and... Man, you got it. I'm still learning how to use the... Uh, top and deal with that other the tear arrows. I don't have enough to build another tear arrow, but I'm still... Still learning how to do that. Stays in cover. Okay, how do we get back up top? I think we're going the right direction, I hope. Okay, Aaron, we can take down this thing. It's basically just an advanced machine. Hey, Lloyd. Ah. Aaron! Yeah, the Spectre's dug its seals in. It's got me pinned down. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Just hurry. Oh god, guys, we gotta go climb, climb, Aloy, climb. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I gotta get to Erend. Erend, I'm here. Pick up someone your own size. Shield down. It's on. Stay put. I'll see what I can do. Heavy weapon. I could use it against the Spectre. Or I could use that acid that it just ran into. Yeah, hit it, hit it, Aaron. Dude, that was sick. 
That was sick. Aloy, she's... Look, I swear I'm not drunk, but right now I'm seeing double. Long story, but it'll have to wait. She needs a healer, but we need to get her back to the base immediately. Right. Yeah. Well, what are we waiting for, then? You two, go on ahead. I need to take another look at that weapon. All right, guys, we've defeated two specters. If I figure out how that thing works, maybe the Zenus won't be so invincible after all. Okay, so where is the specter? What did we just kill? I want to go over here and uh, grab what we can from it, for sure. Hey, guys, what is this? Do you guys see this? It's like, I don't know, it's like molding to the ground. Like, what is that? That is very weird. I don't know. That is really weird. Okay, let's go over here and investigate this weapon. It doesn't hurt you when you run through it, so I think it's okay. I just don't know. It's weird. All their stuff is really weird. Let's see what this weapon's made out of. No. to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. If we can replicate it, maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zenus. I should check on the clone too. Varl, where's our guest? We're in the maintenance corridor below the control room. Okay. Let's check on the clone first, I guess. I just want to see what's up with the clone. It's so weird. Aloy, glad you made it back okay. She panicked after waking up and stumbled down here. I thought it best to wait for you. I'll talk to her. Hello? It's, uh, it's Beta, right? My name's Aloy. What's wrong? Is it your injury? Simulacrum withdrawal syndrome. I don't understand. Sudden removal of a neurologically integrated data device. The brain, especially the cerebellum, goes into a kind of sensory freefall. Everything real feels unreal, distant. Is there anything that can help? Do you have a focus to spare? It's, it's primitive, but I can make it work. Yeah. Booting up. So, uh, Aloy, I suppose you want information. About you and the Zeniths? Yeah. Why are they here? What do they want? How did they get you? But let's start at the beginning. I'm guessing they faked the destruction of their ship a thousand years ago? That seems consistent with their behavior. They wouldn't want to be followed. So far, Zenith established a colony world after all. Yes, for a few hundred years, but it didn't last. Some sort of natural disaster rendered it uninhabitable. Okay, so... The descendants of Far Zenith escaped a dying planet. And now they want to claim Earth for themselves? Not their descendants. What? Not their descendants. It, it, it's them. The same ones who left Earth a thousand years ago. You didn't know? How can they still be alive? They don't even look... What did they do to themselves? I believe it's a combination of pharmaceutical, cellular treatments, and technological implants. And, and you? Does that mean that you are... I'm not like them. I was made. On the way to Earth. On the ship. I spent years studying in my training interface. All so that I could serve my function. Access and control of the terraforming system. But why? 
What did the Zenas want with it? When I discovered the Zero Dawn system had disseminated into its subcomponents, I thought my purpose was to fix it. But I don't think the Zenas want that at all. I think they want to wipe Earth clean and start over. Dang, guys, they are wild. They are crazy. Let's go about the Zenas. So we're dealing with the same Far Zenith people who once lived on Earth. What else do you know about them? They were some of the most affluent and powerful people on Earth. They controlled almost every major resource, every industry. Gerard commands them. He's the one who decided to set up a base. The bald the one others, has to be Jeff Eric, Bezos. Tilda, Verbena. They resent his authority over them, but in the end, they always do what he says. Eric, he's the one I fought back in the Hades Proving Lab. He enjoys hurting people. Yeah, I know. The bald one, guys, has to be Jeff Bezos. <laughs> so the Zeniths want to exterminate life on Earth. That's what Guy and I concluded, too. But why? Why kill everyone just to take over? When they took me on missions with them, I saw how they... butchered. The tribal people we encountered. They didn't seem to care about a rejuvenated Earth, so... I concluded that they must want a hard reboot of the system. Then they can redesign it to be exactly what they want. Mass extinction for their own comfort? Who thinks like that? Well, without their Gaia kernel, they'll have a hard time doing that. The Zenus needed Elizabeth's gene print to access Zero Dawn facilities. So they made you. Trained you. And you went along with it? They told me I was born to interface with the Zero Dawn system. When we reached Earth, I pieced together what must have happened to Gaia and her subordinate functions. That's when I started to realize I wasn't meant to fix Gaia. That they must have made me so I could do what their remote extinction signal failed to do. Reboot Earth for their own benefit. Let's ask about this extinction signal, guys. We've been asking about that one. So you know about the extinction signal? It was speculation, but... The only logical conclusion why Gaia suddenly self-destructed after operating efficiently for centuries. Gaia would have only undertaken such a desperate course of action if it had detected a threat to life on Earth that was more dangerous than ceasing function altogether. I should have realized that she would also order the recreation of Elizabeth Sobek to rebuild her. Yeah, well... Surprise. Okay, guys, last thing I'm going to ask is the Zenith you base. The Zenith set up a base here on Earth. Where is it? Off the coast, I think. Whenever I had to go on missions, I was transported inside of a Spectre drone. I couldn't see anything outside. But I did overhear the Zeniths talking about it once. They were discussing setting up a perimeter energy shield to repel the local fauna. I'm certain they have other security measures. Spectre patrols, machine wars, it... It must be impregnable. What's inside the base? Launch facilities, so they can shuttle back and forth to their ship in orbit. Plus, infrastructure to gather materials and fabricate anything they need. Are there more Zeniths than the ones you met? Uh, I'm not sure. I, I suppose there must be more of them in the base or back on the ship. For all I know, there could be more of them out in space. Other survivors of the colony. Alright guys, I'll let her rest. Alright, I think that's enough for now. Do you... Want to come upstairs, or... So how long? You know, your, your your plan. How long before Gaius fabricated a machine army to defeat the Zenus? How did you know optimal strategy, so? Well, I still have to get two more subordinate functions before Gaius is powerful enough to absorb Hephaestus. What? You don't have Hephaestus already? Gaius is still figuring out how to capture it. It's not confined to a single... To a single location! Of course not! You didn't even know who the Zeniths really are. You were supposed to be further along by now. Coming here was a mistake. They're gonna find me. They're gonna find this place and take me back. This was all for nothing. They're not going to find us. Guy is using Minerva to mask our location. What difference does it make? You're too far behind. We're never going to beat them. Everything. Everyone. I'm gonna die. Hey. Calm down. You're here now, right? 
So is there anything you can do to help? I have certain knowledge sets. And given your state of progress, expertise you probably lack. Geoengineering, of course. Computer science, physics, biology, chemistry. Okay. Well, see if you can do something with that. Talk to Gaia. I'll check on you later. I love her statement of we'll see if you can do something with that. <laughs> How'd it go? Her injury's not that bad, but I think she regrets coming here. Feeling might be mutual. Hmm. I'll come back later and talk to her. See if I can learn anything. I should get the weapon fragment to Gaia. Guys, I know research says that it's usually 50% nature and 50% nurture, but I think in the world of Horizon, it's 100% nurture. Or nature. Dang it, I've messed it up. <laughs> I, wonder what it's like. I think it was 100% nurture? Nature? Nurture. Whichever one's the environment, I honestly can't remember at this time. I think that's nurture. <laughs> Welcome back. Aloy. I see we have a new guest. So now we know the origin of the transmission. Yeah. I also recovered this. The weapon it was part of somehow stripped a zenith of its shield, but it malfunctioned and blew up. If we can recreate the weapon and improve it, maybe we'll gain the upper hand on the zenith. A moment. I will scan it. Complete. By combining the results with data from your focus, I can infer that the weapon was highly advanced, comparable to Zenith technology, but not how it worked. Did the explosion corrupt the data? It was only a catalyst. The moment the weapon malfunctioned, it appears a command executed to purge all data within its core. Ostensibly, this was to prevent the weapon's secrets from falling into enemy hands. Whoever designed this weapon knew how to cover their tracks. Silence. Based on your data on him, that is my conclusion as well. And he's not gonna cooperate with us? Well, it was worth a shot. But that's not all. The Zenus got Eleuthia, along with Artemis and Apollo. That is unfortunate. However, our original plan remains unchanged. The two remaining subordinate functions should increase my heuristic processing density enough to absorb Hephaestus. Right. One problem at a time. Well, I guess I better get back out there. I wish you luck on your search. Right. Thanks, Guy. So I guess we won't be making use of Cylon's weapon. And now there is another clone of Elizabeth here with us. All right, guys, we reached level twenty. Me. I still have two more subfunctions to get. All right, guys, so we have a new quest in here. I'm gonna see what that is. I actually have a lot of skill points to use, which I'm gonna try and use soon. Okay, guys, let's talk to Zoe. That makes you want to punch something. More like someone. Well, you're the one that helped me find it. Aloy. Hey, I thought I'd, uh, check in on how you're doing. You mean, after meeting someone who looks exactly like you, but isn't you, down in the basement? Guess this must be even stranger for you than it is for us, huh? A little. <laughs> Varl said she may be able to help us in our mission, though. Maybe. There is something I'd like to discuss. It's about the land gods. If you have time, that is. Oh my god, there's so many different things. Let's talk about the land gods and skip everything else. You said you wanted to talk about the land gods? I think there's a way to heal them so that they'll once again provide plain song with grain. Gaia gave me a set of instructions. She called it, a uh, reboot code. If we deliver it to the land gods, their derangement will end. Well, that's great. It may be. There are thorns on the path. Unless the code is given by Hephaestus, the land gods will reject it. Gaia showed me a way around this. We need components called control cores from machines made by Hephaestus. Machines similar to the land gods. 
You mean Grimhorns? Like the one we fought in the repair bay? Yes. Gaia helped me locate two of them out west. So, kill the machines, get the control cores, then use them to adapt the reboot code into something the land gods will obey? If all goes well, but taking down two Grimhorns won't be easy. We'll do it together. Bless you, Aloy. I'll send you the location of the machines. All right, guys. I need to get going. May the land bloom in your steps. All right, everyone. So here's the plan. I'm going to check the stash. I'm going to check a couple of my side quests Aloy, and there are more supplies in the chest. Help yourself. I'm going to check this chest as well because um, we're going to head back out and I'm going to see what I'm going to do next, guys. Because we need to head to Poseidon, but I think that's going to be um, something we do here soon. I want to level up just a little bit more, and there's a couple things I want to do. I might check out a couple side quests, and there's also some cauldrons that will allow us to upgrade or actually override some more machines. So I'm going to make a quick cut, guys, and I will see you guys at our next location. Looks like someone's made this space their own. I see you found Varl and Zoe's room, Aloy. I believe they wanted private accommodations. I see. All right, everyone, so we're here at Fall's Edge, and I'm actually meeting back up with Decca. So that's someone that we met in the last video. And um, we're going to continue on this quest line because I wanted to finish this one out. We're going to head up here and meet her. And uh, we're going to continue on, guys. So where is she exactly? Where is she exactly, guys? I'm not completely sure. Okay, so she must be down here. I'm telling the truth. Listen to him, Aroke. Not a chance. He's a traitor. Okay, guys, let's talk to them. Decca, what's going on? Aloy, I'm glad you're here. This is Aroke, leader of Fall's Edge. So you've enlisted the chief's champion in your dull-bladed efforts. You must be Cavo, then. My grandson. And a soldier trying to right his mistakes. Or trying to lure us into a trap. My scouts caught him, sneaking around on the outskirts of the village. I wasn't sneaking around. I was coming to warn you. The rebels are planning an attack. They're going to send a machine straight through this village. I left my post when I realized what they were planning. You have to believe me. Where are the rebels now? They were hunting for the machine north of here. I, I can show you the way. The only thing you'll do is face trial by combat. You betrayed your clan. Your chief. Blood and blades will decide your fate. I'll fight whoever you want after we stop the attack. Let's figure out how we can stop them. If Cavo is telling the truth, this whole village is in danger. We have to find and stop these rebels. The rebels? Built a campfire north of the river, near the cliffs. I can show you the way from there. Okay. Open it up or okay? No. I won't give him the chance to escape. The traitor stays here until his trial by combat. Then I invoke blood for blood. I will take Cavo's place until he returns. You're making a mistake, Chaplain. The clan needs your guidance, not the lies of this bare-armed boy. The right has been called. Cavo will go with Aloy. Then I'm going to. If the boy speaks truth, you'll need my blade. If he lies, I'll run him through. I must make arrangements here first. Then I'll bring the boy to the meeting place. Fine. I'll see you there. All right, everyone, where are we heading now? Let's go to the campfire. Okay, guys, so let's get out of here. This place is really cool. It's a little bit different. Oh, gosh, I am running through the water. This place is really, like, the jungles on this section are absolutely beautiful. The water on here looks amazing. I really like this. There's a rebel outpost over here I need to take out. I'm going to take that out here soon, probably after I do this mission. But um, let's go over here, guys. Go to the campfire. In the next video, we're probably going to be going to Las Vegas to search for Poseidon. And um, that should be very interesting. I think somehow the Poseidon is in the desert. Should be nearby. Stop so long. 
They should be here already. Someone's waiting ahead. But not Cavo or Roque. Rebels. Friends of Cavo's? Going to have to take them out to get to that campfire. Hey guys, I gotta get close to that person there. I need I need Need to eliminate him with the silent strike. Go and check? No, our orders were clear. We hold this position until they arrive. Rebel champion, what is this one? Just a soldier, guys? I gotta get to this champion. I need to throw a rock or something. Where's my rocks? What's the word? I keep forgetting to have a mount that I can just call. I, I don't have to find a new one. I'm trying to look what I should switch to. Okay, guys. I can take out the rest of them. I just need to get this champion quickly. There. See ya. Okay, there we go. That makes things easy. Okay, what am I even on here? I need to, uh, let's see, let's, oh, no you don't. Let me use my melee combat. Oh, no you don't. Ow, that hurt. Okay, that hurt, that hurt, that hurt. Stop. Leave me be. Dude, this guy does not mess around. Oh, I missed my combo. That needs to be some sort of block mechanic. Now that was sick. Dude, that was so sweet. Dude, that is so sick, man. But maybe I just need to use heavy attacks. Were these rebels waiting to ambush whoever showed up? Cavo has some explaining to do. Better wait at the campfire for him and Oroke. Let me find this champion, guys. Let me get this. No, I didn't want to wait here. I wanted to loot. Found a few of your friends when I got here, Cavo. You're not off to a great start. They must have been out on patrol. I swear on the ten, I didn't know they'd be here. What did I tell you? His lies are an open sore. Better we cauterize it now than let it fester. No! I'm telling the truth! Untie him. As you say. But this is a mistake. And my weapon? If you think... Just give it to him, Oroke. We need to get moving. Lead the way. Now, we better not be getting far from that, uh, those valuables box, guys. I'm not, I'm not going... Hold on, you're going to have to wait up. You're going to have to wait just a minute. I have a few things I need to collect. Full, but my stash has room. I got a few things I need to collect. You need to chill out. Okay, now now we can go. <laughs> now we can go, guys. Wait a second. Something else here. Wait just a minute. Okay, now we can go. <laughs> now we can go. I love in this game, guys, they don't make you slow down for the computer. Up this way. If you run, they run. I love it. That's how it should be in every game you play. Where are you leading us? The rebels are stationed at the nearby cliff falls. I took this path when I left my post. The others won't be expecting anyone to come this way. Or they are, and will be skewered the moment we arrive. Well, you got two options then. Kill there's or the be falls. killed. And there's no one there, as I suspected. Guys, this is Let's beautiful. I don't like this. All right, guys, here we go.
I don't know who's climbing where, guys. I'm just gonna pass them up. You guys are too slow. Too slow. <gasps> Aloy, what are you doing? Okay, either way, it worked out. I was like, what is she doing? She just fell off. <laughs> where is everyone? No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there, by the falls. Oh my god, what is that? Behemoth. If that thing runs through Falls Edge, the village stands no chance. Then we stop them. Right here. On your lead, Aloy. So we need to ask him? stand in our way now! Grab your gear. We march on Falls Edge. Okay, guys, I'm going to hit it with one of these, and we're going to try and get it in this acid. Okay, what's the weak point on this thing? Okay, I need to hit those. Okay, there we go. Make it mad. Come on over here, behemoth. Come into the acid. There we go. Ooh, that hurt, guys. Hey, let me hit these. Oh my god, that hurts. I got hit by my own acid. Not good. Hey, got a knockdown. I need more ammo. Oh, there we go. And it's down. Okay, guys. Oh, no. One of our people are down. Oh, that had to hurt. Oh, who's shooting me up here? No, I think uh, the Outlander is going to get you. And you're done. Okay, guys, we're powering this. Th oh, wait, I thought you were dead. Oh, geez, let me hide behind this behemoth. Okay, guys, where are the rest of these people at? There you are. Oh, that was sick. That was so cool. That was absolutely so cool. Oh, I didn't even see this, guys. Thank you. Just the loot comes right to me. I'm trying to get up here, but I can't do it. Oh, well, that didn't do anything at all. Nothing at all. Gotta be quicker than that. Oh, that didn't work, actually. No, 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 no. I didn't mean to throw that at her. <laughs> How's that hitting her armor? Shouldn't that be hitting her right in the face? There we go. We did it. Okay, guys. Let's talk to them real quick. That was a fun battle right there, man. That was a lot of fun taking that behemoth down. We absolutely destroyed that thing. When you learn the elementals... You know the weak points, man. I love this spike thrower. It's so good. Oh my goodness, it's so good. So so good. Cavo, you're bleeding. I'll be fine. What matters is the attack was stopped because of your warning. You saved many lives today. Come on, let's get you back to Falls Edge. I guess I cracked some ribs. Two. Go on ahead. I'll see him back to the village. Okay. I'll let Decca know what happened. All right, everyone. Where are we heading now? Return to Decca. Okay, guys. I'm gonna head that way, and I will see you all when we arrive. Here you are, Aloy. That 
out without Cavo and the Rook. Three leave, only you return? What happened? Cavo was telling the truth. The rebels had a behemoth. Cavo was injured in the battle, but we stopped the attack. Aroke... Regrets that he doubted the boy. Your grandson proved himself to be honest and brave, Chaplain. He's loyal to the Lowland. So you'll release him? He's earned his freedom. But it'll take many more deeds to earn back the rest of the clan's trust. I'll do whatever it takes. A nice little redemption story. That's always good to see. Thank you, Aloy. Indeed. Fall's Edge owes you a great debt. May this begin to repay it. Thank you. As soon as you're healed, I have so much to show you. Welcome back, Cavo. All right, everyone, blood for blood completes. Got some more skill points, guys. We're about to level up again, and uh, let's just let's just continue on, guys. Let's see where we got to go. I think we're gonna probably maybe I might take out a few. In, an ammo that deals fire damage is now available in your inventory. Let's go, guys. So let's see what it is. Let's take a look and see what it is. We have a perimeter trip caster, so we have one that does fire damage now. Okay, guys, so we can shock trip wires, protective shield wires, and it can be upgraded to deal more damage over time. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So we actually have something with fire now, finally. It's taken a little while, but... Shield wires can be fired from certain trip casters. The shield will block all projectiles, but cannot stop physical attacks. Okay, 